Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. In this video, we will cover this lab. So first of all, start lab. In case you get any error like this, don't worry. Reload and click on start lab. It will be started. So in this video, we will cover the lab consuming customer specific data sets from data sharing partners and using BigQuery. So first of all, click on start lab. So a lot of you guys were asking about how to enable this check my progress bar, which you can see I have. So I will share the link in the description Do check it out. So now lab is provisioning, lab is provisioning the resources. Wait for some time. Meanwhile, first of all, click on Data Sharing Partner Console, open in incognito and enter the username. For username, you have to select these two, username and password. Make sure to select carefully. Now click on I understand. Now click on I agree, then click on agree and continue. Now you have to activate the cloud share. So click on the button which I share. Now click on continue. Click on authorize. Now as you can see we are live so first of all make sure to select the command carefully that is the task one command now you have to enter the username of publisher make sure to select the publisher only so now enter the username You have to enter the twin one. Now after publisher you have to enter the twin user. Now wait for some time. It's executing. It's running the job now. the job is done now you have to close the window you can close the browser and now we will move towards the next username that is data publisher first one was a sharing partner but second one is data publisher so use the publisher username and password be careful Now click on I understand. Agree and agree and continue. Now you activate the cloud shell session.
click on continue click on authorize meanwhile if you haven't liked the video like the video and subscribe to the channel for more such amazing contents now you have to use the second command carefully enter now enter the project id so i will share how to enter first of all you need to click on task 2 then navigate here and from here to here make sure there is no extra space or the full stop is being copied so now enter here now we need to enter the twin user so twin username is listed here make sure to select carefully because in this lab if one credential is wrong then your entire effort will be wasted so better watch the video carefully now it's executing again wait for some time so now we are done with this part now we have to move towards the next part so again close the window click leave now we have to open the twin username twin console i mean so use the data twin username and password now click on i understand and now just wait click on i agree and then click on i agree and agree and continue now we have to again activate the cloud shell and select the third command so wait make sure you follow all the step as mentioned in the video and otherwise you may face issue so please watch the video carefully because this lab is easy but it is tricky click on authorize now we have to get back to the repo so let's go back now enter the command now it entered now you have to enter the project id so let me share which project id so that you may not miss any update and the error will happen suddenly sorry for this now let's move to the project id project id we have to move towards the lab instruction as you can see this is the project id of which we have to use watch carefully because we are in the last step only and if you miss you won't get any score so as you can see we have completed the task so click on my progress and you will get a score without any issue and in case you need the scoreboard you can check the description thank